there are four aspects to ensuring good indoor air quality in your home. Particles, pathogens, humidity levels, and gases that build up over time. Right now I'm going to talk about ultraviolet purifiers which kill the pathogens that may be moving through your home's air. Now pathogens are the bacteria, viruses, mold, and fungus that are in every home. Ultraviolet purifiers are great because they're very easy to install and they're incredibly effective at killing those pathogens. Now this is important uh, for improving the healthfulness of the people living in the home. In fact, they're often used in hospitals, restaurant kitchens, and water treatment facilities because they do such a good job. You'll select a UV purifier based on the wattage. The higher the wattage, the better it will do at killing those pathogens. Typically, UV purifiers have one or two bulbs that are inserted right into the ductwork to shine onto the air or surfaces. Surface type are often installed just above the evaporator coil for an air conditioning system to kill the pathogens that like to grow in that dark, damp environment. Whereas the air type can be installed anywhere in this return duct in order to kill those pathogens moving through the air. Now, when changing those bulbs, it's really quite easy. And you only have to do it about one time per year on the models that operate 24 hours a day, seven days a week. There are also models that have a sensor, so they only operate when your system operates. But it's just a matter of sliding the bulb out, like so, and changing it with a new one, and then sliding that new one back in. As far as the installation is concerned, besides inserting them into the ductwork and mounting them right to the outside of the duct, they plug into 110 volt power or there are some models that use a constant 24 volts that can be drawn from the furnace or air handler of your system. So consider UV purifiers as an easy way to greatly increase the indoor air quality in your home.